When you hear silence from Tesla, it never really means nothing is happening. It usually means something huge is being quietly built behind closed doors. For months, that silence surrounded what people had started calling a myth, the Tesla Model 2. An affordable Tesla, something ordinary families could buy, seemed to be fading away. But in true Tesla fashion, that silence was just the sound of a storm gathering. And this week, a small but powerful signal broke through. Two mysterious internal projects, NV91 and NV93, began to surface again from Tesla's internal systems. To most people those names mean nothing. But to those who follow Tesla closely they mean everything. Because these are the projects directly tied to what will become the 2026 Tesla Model 2, a car expected to be priced under $12,000. Yes, under $12,000. It sounds almost impossible. But impossibility has always been Tesla's favorite challenge. Now, what makes this news believable isn't just rumor or speculation. It's the mindset Elon Musk revealed recently when he said Starlink's emergency internet access will be free for anyone who needs it. Think about that. Free global connectivity. And now Tesla is preparing to bring that same philosophy into its most affordable vehicle ever, by including free Starlink internet for life. That's not a dream. That's a glimpse of the future. Welcome back to Torque Element, your home for fact-based Tesla updates before anyone else. We're on the road to reaching 2,000 subscribers and you're part of this story. So buckle up because this one changes everything. Let's start from where it all began. Deep inside Tesla's engineering headquarters, where those NV projects were thought to be frozen. For months, analysts said Tesla had abandoned the $25,000 car plan. But insiders now say Tesla never canceled it, they just hit pause to test something far more advanced. You see, Tesla doesn't operate like traditional automakers. When most car companies scale up they build cars faster and cheaper, but only up to a certain point. Their cost per unit goes down with volume but not forever. Tesla changed that equation. With the next generation manufacturing platform, Tesla can now reduce cost per car continuously, not temporarily. So when NV91 was paused, it wasn't because it failed. It was because Tesla wanted to prove its radical new manufacturing process first, using the existing Model 3 and Model Y lines as test beds. It's like testing a new heart on a healthy patient before transplanting it into someone in critical condition. Once the system worked, Tesla could safely transplant that innovation into the Model 2. This new platform uses gigacasting, massive aluminum castings that replace 70 body parts with just two. It uses structural battery packs that act as part of the frame itself. It eliminates thousands of welds and bolts. And it's this precision engineering that makes a car costing Toyota $28,000 to build cost Tesla only $18,000. That's not hype. That's raw manufacturing math. But beyond the spreadsheets and factory floors, what this means is revolutionary. Imagine a world where the average American family, spending $600 a month on car payments and $200 more on fuel, could suddenly cut both in half. Imagine freeing $400 every single month. Money that could go to your child's education, your home, or your savings. That's what Model 2 stands for. It's not about luxury anymore. It's about giving mobility back to ordinary people. Tesla's production focus is razor sharp on the markets that can make this dream real. California, Texas, Florida, and New York. Together, these four states represent almost 40% of all electric vehicle sales in the country. Each one has a growing EV infrastructure. California already leads the charge. Texas is electrifying its highways faster than ever. Florida's charging corridors stretch across the state, and New York's urban centers make EVs practical for millions. By the time Model 2 launches, these states will be ready to make affordable electric driving mainstream. Now, let's address the elephant in the room. Those reports in early 2024 that claimed Tesla had canceled the project. The truth? They missed what was really happening. Tesla wasn't shutting down anything. It was quietly qualifying suppliers for smaller, cheaper components. Battery packs, cast parts, even interior systems that didn't match the current Model 3 or Model Y specs. Every tool order placed, every supplier vetted, was proof that Tesla was preparing for something smaller, smarter and more affordable. And when a company like Tesla spends tens of millions on specialized tooling, that's not for a canceled project. That's for something about to change the game. The brilliance behind the Model 2 isn't just about affordability. It's about sustainability and long-term ownership value. Let's talk about that free Starlink integration, because this part makes the Model 2 unlike any car on Earth. Right now, Tesla owners pay around $10 per month for premium connectivity, access to music streaming, live traffic, satellite maps, and video streaming. 
Over 8 years that's nearly $1,000 in subscription fees. But with Model 2 that cost disappears. Why? Because Tesla doesn't need to pay cellular carriers anymore. They own the satellite network. Starlink second generation satellites, over 7,000 of them orbiting the Earth right now, allow Tesla to provide internet access directly, bypassing traditional mobile carriers. And here's the genius. Each satellite can handle around 4,000 simultaneous car connections. When 2 million Model 2s hit the road, the bandwidth cost per car drops to less than $3 per year. That's basically free. And with that connection comes a new kind of car. One that's alive, aware, and constantly improving. Software updates anywhere on the planet. Navigation in areas where your phone loses signal. Real-time vehicle diagnostics. Predictive maintenance that tells you what's wrong before it happens. Security alerts that notify you instantly if your car is moved without your permission, even in the middle of nowhere. For people living in rural Texas or driving across the deserts of California or heading through storm zones in Florida, this isn't just convenient, it's life-saving. When cellular towers go down, Starlink stays online. In emergencies, your car becomes a communications hub, able to send messages or request help even when every phone around you has gone silent. That's the level of independence and safety Tesla wants to bring to everyone, not just luxury buyers. Now all of this connectivity would mean nothing without energy to keep moving, and this is where Tesla's next trick enters the story. The auto recharging surface. What if your car could recharge itself? Not just a few extra miles here and there, but meaningful, daily range powered by the sun? Tesla's engineers have developed high-efficiency solar cells with 28% conversion efficiency. That's nearly double what typical rooftop solar panels could do five years ago. These cells are integrated directly into the roof, hood, and rear deck of the Model 2, creating almost 3 square meters of solar collection area. Under bright sunlight, that's around 780 watts of clean, self-generated power. Across a full day, those panels can capture around 4 kilowatt hours of energy. Now, that may not sound like much, but in Tesla's ultra-efficient Model 2, which uses roughly 240 watt-hours per mile, that's around 16 miles of free driving per day. No plug. No cord. Just sunlight. But Tesla's secret sauce isn't the panels themselves, it's how they use that energy. Most car makers that tried solar EVs in the past failed because they tried to charge the main battery directly while driving, which created overheating and efficiency losses. Tesla solved that with a 2.5 kilowatt hour buffer battery. It stores solar energy throughout the day and transfers it to the main pack when it's most efficient, usually at night when temperatures drop. This method improves usable energy capture by about 50%. In sunny places like Southern California or Texas, this setup could give you over 7,000 free solar miles per year. Even in upstate New York, you'd still get more than 5,000. It's not just eco-friendly, it's real, functional independence. During a power outage that system still works. Your car still charges. You still move. Remember the Texas power crisis back in 2021? When the grid failed, EV owners were stranded, unable to charge. A solar integrated Model 2 wouldn't have had that problem. It could keep driving day after day regardless of grid status. That's not just convenience, that's freedom. And in true Tesla style, the car won't just sit still soaking up sunlight. The Model 2's hood can automatically tilt upward by about 7 degrees when parked to catch the perfect angle of the sun. It adjusts itself based on your GPS location and time of day, almost like a sunflower that follows the light. It's subtle, intelligent, and completely automatic. Now, let's think about the economics again. These solar cells cost under 60 cents per watt when produced at scale. That means the entire solar system, the panels, buffer battery, and installation, costs Tesla under $1,000 per vehicle. Yet it can save owners over $2,000 in electricity over its lifetime. It pays for itself in about four years. After that, it's pure benefit, free miles forever. And when you combine that with Starlink's lifetime connectivity, Tesla's message becomes clear. They're not just selling cars anymore. They're selling independence, from fuel, from the grid, from cellular carriers, and even from planned obsolescence. Because with Tesla's over-the-air updates, your car doesn't get older every year. It gets smarter. So where does all this leave us? 
The Model 2, priced under $12,000, isn't just an affordable EV. It's a statement. It says the era of electric exclusivity is ending. The electric car is no longer a symbol of status. It's about practicality, safety, and long-term value. Think about what this means for the next decade. Millions of people who never thought they could own a Tesla suddenly can. Rural communities gaining reliable, off-grid mobility. Families saving hundreds every month while driving something safer, cleaner, and smarter than any gas car at double the price. It's not just a vehicle. It's a redefinition of what transportation can be. And through all of this, the silence that once surrounded the Model 2 now sounds like strategy, like Tesla quietly preparing to reshape the very foundation of the auto industry once again. So, when you see those mysterious NV91 and NV93 projects being whispered about again, don't dismiss them as just technical codes. See them for what they are, the first tremors before a new electric revolution. Tesla's Model 2 isn't just coming. It's coming to rewrite the rules of what affordable mobility means in America, and eventually across the world. And if there's one thing history has taught us about Tesla, it's this. When people doubt them, that's when they're usually the closest to a breakthrough. Stay tuned, because Torque Element will be watching every step of this story. And by the time the Model 2 hits the road, we won't just be spectators. We'll be witnesses to a transformation decades in the making. So, if you believe in smart innovation, in energy independence, and in the idea that the best technology should be for everyone, not just the wealthy, then you're already part of this story. Because the future isn't waiting. It's quietly being built, right now, in Tesla's factories, under those project names that only a few people understand. But soon everyone will.